All right, what's going on, you guys? Nick here with Next Round of Power. So I'm going to make kind of a preview video here for the 2018 IFBB Indy Pro um, in Indianapolis, Indiana. This is the first year ever they are holding this pro show. And I actually signed on to be a sponsor of this show, so you should see me there. I'll be there covering it. And you should see my logo somewhere up on that stage. So this show is an Olympia qualifier, so that means the winner of this show will qualify for the Olympia if they have not already. Um, so the stakes are high for some of these guys that you know might come out of the woodwork to win this show. But first, I'm going to read you guys the list of the open competitors, and there's also a 212 competition. So it's a pro open and pro 212 show. So we have Dorian Adams. We've got Aaron Clark, who is a former 212 competitor that we have not seen on stage since 2015, um, where he competed in the 212 Olympia, I believe. We got Wendell Floyd. You got Roman Fritz, who has a crazy classic physique. Charles Griffin, Dorian Haywood, Kenneth Jackson. You've got Steve Kuklo who just recently came in fifth at the 2018 Arnold Classic in Columbus, Ohio. In my opinion, um, probably one of the most improved bodybuilders that we saw at the Arnold Classic this year. You've also got Michael Lynn, Joseph Mackey, Milton Martinez. You've got Blair Moan, Justin Rodriguez, who we recently saw at the New York Pro in 2017. This guy has an incredible physique, and in my opinion, he's probably a pick for the top six. Um, you've got Luke Sando, who just competed in the Arnold Australia, placing sixth there, um, where he looked absolutely phenomenal, in my opinion, and deserved a much higher placing than sixth. You've got John Sylvie. You've got Fred Biggie Smalls, Mitchell Stats, Derek Upshaw, Ian Vallier, and Hidetada Yamagishi. So of this list, I think the main guys we need to pay attention to are Steve Kuklo, Luke Sando, Hide, Aaron Clark, and Justin Luis Rodriguez. So my prediction for the men's open is we're probably going to see Steve Kuklo win this show. Um, and in my opinion, we'd probably have either Hide and Luke Sando in second. I would really like to see Luke Sando in second place because I'd really love to see that call out um, of him and Steve Kuklo going head to head because I think they both have pretty big physiques. Um, in terms of overall muscle mass, Luke Sando has a very Dorian Yates-esque physique. Um, conditioning has been the main problem for Luke Sando. Um, and while Steve Kuklo has a lot of size, conditioning was one of his stronger points this year at the Arnold Classic. So I think that would be a good call out and a good comparison for those two. Then you throw a guy like Hide in the mix that comes in with a lot less size, um, but some of the craziest conditioning you're going to see on that stage um, if we see anything like we saw at the Arnold in the Arnold Australia. And then, of course, as a 212 competitor, we had Aaron Clark, who looked, you know, pretty amazing for the 212 division. I think this is a guy that we could see sneak into the top six as well. This is a guy that has a very complete physique. Um, he has very few weak points. He has a lot of muscle mass for a 212 guy, which is obviously why he's doing open now. I think one of the main points he needs to watch out for, though, is his waistline. That's something that I've seen. It looks like it's been growing um, since the last time he competed, so that might be something that really hinders him in placings. So my overall prediction is going to be Steve Kuklo winning it. You're going to have Luke Sando hopefully in second, Hide Tadayamagishi in third. I would say you could probably go with Justin Rodriguez, maybe in that fourth place spot. And Aaron Clark somewhere cracking the top six. Another guy to look out for would be Roman Fritz. I think he's got a great physique, but maybe not enough size to crack into a lineup this deep. I mean, there's 20 competitors, um, so it's not really a small show or a small lineup. So in the 212 division, you've got Ahmad Ahmad, Thomas Anderson, Ben Barks, Lyndon Belgrave, Brad Davis, Charles Dixon, who recently took second at the 2018 Arnold Classic. You've got Ahmad El Sadani. You've got Michael Urgus, Ahmad Fazi, um, Darren Glenn, Walter Martin, Eric Martinez, Silvio Samuel, Jose Raul Sanchez Reyes, and Wayne Williams, as well as Jacob Wilson. So my pick to win the 212 um, is obviously going to be Charles Dixon based on how um, he plays at the Arnold Classic. Other guys to look out for, I would say Ahmad Ahmad. I mean, pretty much most of the other names on this list are guys that I haven't really heard of. So I would say Charles Dixon and Ahmad Ahmad would be the two main guys to look out for. I believe Jose Raymond was supposed to do this show, but he backed out at the last minute. Um, but his wife is competing in the pro bikini, I believe. So Jose will still be there. So that's the preview video, guys. I hope to see some of you guys at the Indy Pro. It's going to be a great show. It's always good to have another pro show on the roster, on the schedule. So let me know what your guys' predictions are for the 2018 Indy Pro Show. Thank you guys for watching the video. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Nick Strength and Power, signing out.